Welcome back, I'm Nicole B. W. and this is Project Ozone. This is the last villager. He's a farmer that has nothing to farm. How sad. So, I have been working all weekend uh, on this max size reactor. Uh, I am in the process of filling it up with jelly cryothium. I have diamond blocks. I went ahead and um, put the rods in there as well. Uh, so if we fly up here, you can see this is the pattern I went ahead and it made. I don't have it all filled up, but I'm working on it. It's taking forever. I also went ahead and flew around the end. There were a ton of comments, comments that I found in the end. I don't know what the deal was. I've never found so many comments. I think I found like six of them, six or seven, uh, within like 1500 blocks of the island. Uh, so yeah, I was able to make two max size uh, draconic uh, energy ball things, thingamajigs. So as soon as I turn this on, uh, these will get filled up. That is part of the achievement book. Uh, so I was working on this. I got this one done. Um, and I've just been looking and you know, uh, Project Ozone 2 is out. And I kind of really want to do that. And there is a lot of outer space stuff in that. There are a ton. There's probably 10 different sections and there are a ton of quests per section. So I kind of want to work on that actually. And there is a ton of outer space stuff. I think you have to go like pretty dang far uh, in that. So I kind of want to just switch to Project Ozone 2 if you guys don't mind. Um, so this would be easy once I get this. I'll be able to fill up this. This is one of the uh, energy cores, max size energy cores. Uh, we'll fill that up. Uh, that's not going to be a problem. I can also do a massive, massive solar farm in uh, the mining age to help fill it up even faster uh, because I have basically infinite EMC uh, so that's not going to be a problem at all. Uh, this I can't do because I haven't gone into outer space. Uh, this is just a lot of these is just a matter of uh, me making it and setting it up uh, which you know is kind of a duh thing. Uh, but with EMC and a lot of stuff, having EMC, it just seems kind of uh, pointless at this point. Um, so uh, a couple people have uh, replied and said that they want me to move on. Uh, one person has said that they want me to continue with this world. So I'm going to move on but continue with Project Ozone 2. And there is an achievement book in that one as well. Uh, so I'm going to do that. It is, I'm going to play the Skyblock version. So because I play so many Skyblocks, I'm going to um, go ahead and work on the beginnings of that and get it, uh, get to a point where it's not boring because it's all kind of grindy in the beginning uh planting trees chopping trees making you know the platform out of wood all of that stuff getting to a point where i have automatic cobble gin uh, i'll probably work on all of that off camera before i start recording that if um it's the same thing every single sky block in the beginning. So I really don't want to record that too much. Um, but let's go, you know what? I'm going to hop over to the world over there and uh, we'll take a look at the quest book. Um, and you guys can see 
what is in store. So I will be right back. See, that wasn't very long. Uh, I did go ahead and uh, I kind of cheated a little bit. I made a platform uh, with some glowstone glass, uh, but I did take away most of the dirt that was like, this is just a flat layer of grass. There is nothing under there. Uh, so I did the gardens of glass uh, world, uh, but it, uh, but I took away all of the extra stuff that it came with, except for some grass. Uh, and I went ahead and I pre-planted a tree. It kind of grew into kind of a medium sized one. Uh, but let's take a look at the quest book, which is what you guys wanted to see in the first place. Uh, so, um, this is Project Ozone 2 Reloaded. And uh, the rules are the same as last time. Uh, da, 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 da. So, all of these people helped create, um, I think they helped create it. Anyway, uh, so there's a normal mode, and there's a titan mode, uh, and then there's a kappa mode, which is harder than titan. Titan. Uh, but I'm just going to go on through the normal mode. Now, you can see there's alpha, beta, gamma, delta, epsilon, uh, Zeta, Eta, 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 I don't know, uh, Theta, Iota, Kappa, Lambda, Mu, Nu, that's it. So there's 13 sections, uh, and so let's take a look. This is the first section, and yes, there are a lot, and I will probably get, uh, like, a good section of this started um, so I, I will not be opening chance cubes I will be uh, opening the reward bags uh, but I will keep any really cool ones and I'll let you guys know in the first episode uh, get water oh and I uh, got rid of the water that started here so I'm starting out with zero water uh, just so you know uh, the beta is this huge amount of uh there's gamma delta yes so many so many uh theta just a so many quests to do um, this one's not so much, but it looks like it's uh, RF tools, and um, yeah, that's not going to be fun. Um, oh, and you got uh, the ether uh, along with it. Did I already do that? I think I did that one. So this is the one for outer space. A lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. A lot a lot so that's why I kind of wanted to go ahead and uh, do this I'm not going to have um, anything I, I'm, I'm not having you know I don't have EMC to help me get through it I don't have uh, and there is the achievement book in the last one so uh, it's a lot of quests and I am kind of excited and want to do this and I want to do more of uh, the engineering stuff uh, for power in the beginning. I think that'll be fun to do some water wheels and stuff. Uh, so I kind of want to get this started. Uh, like I said, I made a platform. I looked at the pre-made designs and one of them kept crashing, so I couldn't even look at that one. Um, the other one looked like a, just a big moon. Um, so I made stuff, besides the glowstone glass, this stuff really isn't very um, effective. And there's stairs here, so I need to be careful I don't fall off. Uh, so I made it a little bit more challenging uh, that way because there are stairs. Uh, so when I go to expand it out, it's going to be difficult 
uh, but hopefully I can do it without falling off. Um, but yeah, so I'm kind of excited about it and I can't wait. I'm, we're in a Savannah Plateau, uh, it looks like, so I hope it rains in the Savannah. <laughs> if not, I'm uh, gonna have to platform out until I uh, find an area that does rain. Uh, so, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Let me know what you think down below. And, um, yeah, so that, this is the last episode for Project Ozone 1. And, um, yeah, I'm kind of excited. There's a lot of stuff to do uh, for this. So, like I said, I'm just going to skip the beginning uh, and come back when I at least have uh, automated cobble uh, from my cobble gin. Uh, that's the bare minimum and I might go a little longer for that, uh, but I should have a, a very basic mob farm set up, a uh, automatic cobble gin, um, uh, I should have some tinkers tools um, and yeah so I should at least have that stuff by the time you see the first episode uh, so I hope you guys enjoy it let me know what you think down below I know I already said that uh, but I really do want your opinions and um, yeah I'll see you guys in the next episode this guy is so pretty that's why I like gardens of glass it's so pretty Alright, bye-bye.